keeping you and your kids safe at the game. One local school district is taking new steps to do just that. 41 Action News reporter Mackenzie Nelson joins us live ahead of a game in the Hickman Mills District. So Mackenzie, what exactly do fans need to know here? Well, Kevin, it started last week and it's being implemented again tonight and at every future home game. And you can see behind me, there are wands that are being used on every single fan before they're allowed to walk into the stadium. Everyone entering just was compliant and allowed for the process to take place and went on in the game and enjoyed. Last week, the Hickman Mills School District added to its security protocol. And when you're taking extra measures to ensure safety, why complain, especially in this world where we continue to hear about these devastating events? Superintendent Yolanda Cargyle said all fans attending a Ruskin High School home game will be screened. Handheld wands will be used at football games and metal detectors for basketball. But I went through it last time we had a game last weekend and I, I feel great. I know that everybody's going to be safe. We don't have to worry about people coming in with weapons or anything happening. So I feel really safe on the inside of the game. The district says it's a proactive approach, joining professional, collegiate, and other high schools around the metro with the same protocols. I feel confident that I can say to any parent, any one of our board members, any community stakeholders that we have a process in place to ensure that attendees are safe. School districts in KCK, KC Mo, and Grandview use metal detectors or wands. As for the center school district, Kansas City police officers attend all games. Parents like Tara Charles appreciate the district's efforts. I think it's actually great because a lot of people have like a negative image about our district, and we are doing everything we can to keep everybody safe and make sure everybody's happy and they feel welcome when they come in our district. So I think it's great that they're doing that. So the school district said buying the metal detectors and the handheld uh, wands, it was a minimal cost, but it will make a big impact for their security protocols. Live in Kansas City, Mackenzie Nelson, 41 Action News.